Hey guys. So, uh, so when we got reset up in the uh, classic beta, it wiped our characters and gave us the ability to uh, create um, um, pre-made characters at up to level 40. Um, the level cap is level 45, so you can level to level 45 from 40 from any character you want, just pre-made, create it. It's got some generic gear. The gear is, the gear is pretty LOL if you haven't seen it already. Um, it's got a lot of strength on it for uh, for rogues. Um, some of it, some of the gear you wouldn't actually end up with at this level. Um, but yeah, it's it's pretty mad. Um, but anyways, so having done that, what they did was they give you poisons, right? Um, but in the game, to get poisons, you have to complete a quest. Okay, and it starts here. Um, and then you go to this tower, and then you you uh, you complete the tower quest, and you bring it back to Stormwind, and you you get your poisons. And when you complete that, you also get your thistle tea recipe. Um, no one has actually done that quest on any of these characters in the beta at all, um, because we were all pre-created with poisons without that quest. And we're way past the level range for people to have gotten it. Unless you go to the specific quest giver who has that quest, which I've done. Um, uh, so that's what I'm going to do right now. I've got the rogue poison quest. I'm going to complete the rogue poison quest, even though I've already got poisons on this pre-made character. Specifically for Thistle Tea. Uh, I also went ahead and grabbed cooking, because you have to level that up to like 50 or 60 or something for the Thistle Tea recipe. Um, and um, I went ahead and grabbed uh, herbalism as well. Um, so I can, um, get the, uh, Mage Royal and Briar Thorn that will spawn Swift Thistle for the tea. Um, cause what good is having the recipe if you don't have any of the actual Swift Thistle. So, and then the fun part will be after that, um, stun locking someone into obliteration, um, with a Thistle double backstab eviscerate. So...